Good morning. Welcome to Radio's Retreat. I'm Paul, and I am going to show you what I'm planning on reading in January. I know I'm a little late, but for the first week, I'm reading The Demonist. And we'll, and I'm planning on getting this finished here, uh, either today or tomorrow. So I hope that I can do that. Now, I'm trying to figure out where to put the books. Give me a minute. I should have had this figured out, but I didn't. Oh. Let's deal with that one there. Put that one back there. That one back there. Who else has too much junk on their side tables? Anyway, I'm going to get me a dip. Give me a minute. Oh. Anyway, the second week, I'm playing on reading Kim Harrison, The Undead Pool. And this is what I'm going to be focusing on uh, on the second week. Then, the third week, I am going to be reading uh, Dead Man's Hand, which is the first book of James J. Butcher. And don't get this young man mixed up with Jim Butcher, even though Jim Butcher is his father. So, uh, so when I first bought it, I thought someone was trying to build on Jim Butcher's name. But I got it and stuff, and I learned that James J. Butcher is Jim Butcher's son. And that is so good to see fa another family kept going into writing. So this is what I'll be reading on the third week. The fourth week, I will be reading Spider's Bite by, by Jennifer Eastap. This is the first book of the Elemental Assassin books. And I believe I got all the books that goes to this series, so this is going to be the next one. <laughs> so, those those are the four main books I'm going to be reading. Now, if I need something to read in between them or something like that, then I'll be picking up this book, Stephen King's the, Under the Dome. I'm already up on page... 408 and let's try to get this finished also so I decided this is the way I was going to do it now uh, before February hits I will be doing something like this for February showing uh, the one book you know showing one book per week and then I'll show the uh, book that I'm going to be reading uh, between everything. It's probably going to be the same book, to tell you the truth. So, I can't wait to get back into it. I need to get the rest of this series, though. That is an awesome series. And, uh... Now, I do do uh, spare time reading, if anybody wants to join me. I usually do it off my head, very seldom do I, do I uh, schedule it, but uh, I'm planning on doing more reading sprints also. So, we'll see about that. Excuse me. So we're going to go on and see what can be done. Uh, can't wait to get through to all these books. And uh, like I said, The Demonist is an awesome book. I have enjoyed that <sighs> a lot. Uh, 
after I wake up completely, I might even do a little bit of read. Maybe I'll do some live rereading here on uh, the channel. But I am like 65% done with this book at this point in time. I shouldn't have much. It should. It shouldn't take much for me to finish that. I mean, ain't that much there. Okay, there's the epilogue. I'm trying to see. I am on uh, 14th chapter. There's 20 chapters plus the epilogue. So I guess you can say 21 chapters. So I'm almost done with this book. And I, and I can't wait to see how it ends. But at the same time, I don't want it to end. Uh, so you guys take care. And I'll be seeing everybody later.